oil blotting paper. What's oil blotting paper? It's a girl thing. The two on the left are my heavy book, which I use for flower pressings, and then my super pop-up book. A super pop-up book? When you open it, it pops out with the force of a raging river! When an enemy has me cornered, I can just open it up facing a nearby wall and pop! Instant getaway! The only downside is that it's a real pain to try to get closed again, so I haven't used it in years. What about the book right in front? That's actually layer cake. Whoa, really? <laughs> Seared into its batter are precious bits of knowledge. Eating it is just as good for your brain as it is for your stomach. Wow, I had no idea that was possible. He's taking this so seriously, I almost feel bad. All of your books are so interesting, Moggy Lou. That's really cool. <laughs> There's no end to your curiosity, is there? What do you say? Want to take a closer look? Boy, would I. If you really do, then say, Moggy Lou, I want to get to know you better. Oh, my God. Moggy Lou, I want to get to know you better. All right, I accept. I'll reveal to you my most private secrets. Wow, so that's what's on the other side of these books. I wouldn't have ever guessed that. What the? What are you doing with Lofty Set? He said he wanted to see, so I'm showing him. You have no right to stand in the way of his desires. It's my job to protect him as his vessel, especially from someone so wicked as yourself. Also, what you're doing runs contrary to public decency, which is aren't supposed to be decent. These bindings with the locks on them. This style used to be really popular during the Meliodas dynasty. Now that I know you're such a bad influence for him, I'll be keeping a closer eye on you. If you can't learn to take it easy, nobody's ever going to want to marry you, you know. Like you're a shining example of marriage material yourself. <laughs> Mommy Lou, could you turn them over one more time? I want to see how the book's attached to your belt. Yeah, sure. <sighs> <laughs> hey, Moggy Lou, I was wondering about that book you have on your waist. The one you called your heavy book for flower pressings. Your curiosity truly knows no bounds, does it, kiddo? Okay, nobody else knows this, but since you're so interested, I'd hate to leave you hanging. My heavy book, the one I use for flower pressings, is none other than a collection of Bienfu's poetry. Bienfu likes to write poems? Yep. You'd never guess it, but he's actually just about the best Moloch poet around. Some people even call him the Great Norman Poet. Here, I'll read you my favorite one. If there is something unimportant happening to the East, I'm made to go there and back. If there is something unimportant happening to the West, I'm made to go there and back. I can never rest nor be at peace. Every day my life is a living hell. That's... Wonderfully, aggressively heavy. Moggy Lou, your face has gone all sinister looking. <laughs> uh, one second here. All right, get more comfortable. I'm gonna feel. I'm all right though. So, uh, y'all didn't hear no noise, so it should be fine. When I almost fell. <sighs> Combo senses, huh?
Damn it. They could have aimed it terribly. Oh my goodness, no spells, man. Damn it! I fucked up. Whoop. Oh. Damn it. God damn it, stop taking my shit. Oh my goodness, man. See how easily you get destroyed? If I make the wrong decision in the fight. They keep taking my shit. Oh my god. Oh my god, we might die to this dumb shit. Damn, that was such a terrible fight, man. What the fuck happened there? I thought we were done. What did we do? How did we mess that up so bad? Oh my god, it, it comes to show you, bud. Better watch it, you can die in the instant. Man. Play like shit or something. I don't know. I wasn't even worried about that in that fight. Like I saw the monster. I was like, we can destroy them. All right. 
I keep forgetting about my Mr. Art, man. God damn it. We'll just skip all the monsters in here. Expedition return. New area to discover. Scouts. The map's getting filled in little by little. There's still a long way to go. It's a big world out there. Yeah. That's true. And a lot can happen on the waves. The far seas are unexplored territory for a reason. I'd imagine so. The seasons and the weather can change the sea completely. Oh. Do I sense a budding interest in the sea? Think you're feeling less apathetic about it now? I wouldn't say that. I was just reminded of something someone once said to me. That same fight could destroy me as well though if I'm playing like shit. Hey, 
It's nothing special. Oh my god. Yeah, light bar. Hmm. <laughs> 